it's the mental hurdle of, you know, having to fight yourself, you know, having to battle yourself because you're not playing against nobody, you know. I didn't touch the court for about, you know, eight months. The hardest part was getting through, you know, the, the hospital, that whole situation, you know, is, is, is my, my knee, is my leg going to be okay? And, of course, they was talking about the whole, uh, you know, amputation and all that. They threw that around early because of the, you know, blood flow and all that. Once mm. that was good, okay, I'm out the woods. Now what's the timeline? Doctors don't have nothing. They ain't giving me mm. nothing. So how am I supposed to know when I'm actually able to come back? Where am I tracking at? They just gave me a year. You know, about a year, you should, you know, that's kind of give or take. That's the timeline. But it, it's just a mental process of, again, trusting yourself. And it was, it was just a struggle, man. Uh, physically, you're not the same person. Uh, man, having to ice your knee. You know, I was icing my knee five, six times a day. When I came back, you know, playing in the G League, you know, icing my knees between halftime, like, mm. you know, just uh, trying to get the swelling down. How long did it take you to feel like yourself again? It was probably about, man, probably, I'd say about five years. Damn, that's five fucking years. Old.